TOPS building is the Training and Operational Support Building. It's a 500,000 square foot building that houses our training as well as our NOC, which is our operations control. This training facility itself has 36 classrooms. It has emergency areas such as CPR and self-defense. It has emergency aircraft um, evacuation for our flight attendants. It has a full gate experience, a ticket counter experience. Um, the goal is to ensure that all employees, before they move out to their respective locations, they get the training and the tools here so that when they go to serve our customers, they are prepared. A couple years ago, we realized with the complexity of this airline, we needed to start bringing more resources together in an integrated fashion so we could provide better information for our stations, which in turn would give better information to our customers. And clearly, as you can look around this room, you have all types of technology being piped in here. It gives us much better situational awareness so we can provide the information that has to get out to the field. Because when we started this, we had exactly five different operational disciplines on the floor. Today we have 14 different disciplines from the airline on the floor. Our belief is that if you really want to make sure you're getting the very best for the airline to provide the very best service for you guys, we got to put the subject matter experts on the floor together and make sure you're sharing the right information. The speed of the information is absolutely critical. It allows us to make better decisions because it's, as you would expect, it's, it's literally moving at 500 miles an hour, the airline is. And when you launch into Chicago and you have flights that are coming from all over the country, at any given time you could have as many as 50 in the air, you've got to start making decisions because you can't just turn it off. It takes time. Here.